Welcome to React Extraction. How are you doing out there? I'm Quint. I'm Ty. Today we're doing Killing Joke. Interesting name. Mm -hmm. uh, UK band, 1985. But we're so used to hearing kind of uh, American music from 1985, mid-80s. Early alternative, uh, not, not necessarily punk. It wasn't in, really in America at the time. It just became more pop everything. But this band is interesting. Not really mainstream, okay? But their sound and this punk rock, you know, I, I, it's the beginning of alternative is what I, I hear in my head. But I'm curious to get your vibe on this because I think it's just really, really good. Okay. And you like bands that aren't exactly, you know, the most popular, mm -hmm. right? Stuff that has cred. Mm -hmm. Killing Joke definitely has cred. I'm sure they came from a punk influence, obviously. But they turned it and twisted it into an alternative sound that I thought was really, really good. Oh, okay. So I got to get your vibe. Let's do it. Love like blood.
piano. Dun. This note right here, is good. so good. Many different elements in there because it's so early 1985. The guitar, yeah, that's heavier. That would be featured later in music. Mm -hmm. Totally, much less punk, much more. It might sound like rock now, or does it sound like alternative? What do you think? It sounds like sort of alternative. I think like in the beginning, like the guitar that you're talking about sounds more of like an upbeat pop indie not indie but like i don't know yeah. alt, alt rock kind of thing yeah and then it turns into like this heavy kind of grunge yeah. head banging stuff so it's really cool to like kind of hear the progression through the song through that because it and, the, and the, the the chorus is just so haunting you know what i mean just those yeah. note changes yeah it's just amazing all around this is one of my favorite songs you've showed me great um i just i like all the reverb on all this stuff it mm -hmm. just totally kind of fits my vibe that's cool um, and it's interesting because at the time, that's not what they knew they were doing, mm -hmm. you know, because it wasn't around yet. So I like the fact that they're just raw talent of Killing Joke. From their background, they didn't understand what this would sound like in 30 years. Yeah. You know, so if it's a pop <coughs> rock, alternative rock, indie rock, darker, whatever it is, it's interesting to look back at it now. And so your vibe is alternative heavier. Mm-hmm. Which I guess is what they were going for. Music just, gosh, it just changes over time. The perception changes. Yeah. And it, dude, it's kind of mainstream sounding now when at the time it wasn't. Yeah. And that, that piano is just so chilling. Yeah. It just like shivers your bones when <laughs> that key just drops. Like It really does. Only three or four times, which is perfect. Because you don't want to get too sensitized to it. But like, yeah, yeah, I mean, it was really cool. This voice really meshed all just through kinda, the song yeah he's just kind of crooning through just letting it like just speak for itself you know totally it's just, it just fits because if he was throwing too many words in there trying to fit something else no nah, it wouldn't work yeah because that's just, not kind of the that's not the band they are no that's it, not the band that's perfect i'm yeah i'm thinking the cult i'm thinking psychedelic furs mm -hmm. i'm thinking in that era i mean 1985 you really are ahead of your time creating a sound that would morph into an alternative mainstream thing, but I love the fact that they didn't know that's what they were doing. <laughs> yeah. They were just a, a really, really fabulous band. Um, and this is uh, just a song I thought introducing you to, Killing Joke. I thought uh, this is a speed way to go. It sounds like you liked it. Yeah, I liked it. Good. Fabulous. All right, Killing Joke, Love Like Blood. All right, guys. Go 1985. Thanks for checking this reaction extraction out with us. That was the killing joke. Go ahead and check out our other stuff on the channel. There's stuff for everyone. Hope you enjoy. We'll see you there. Yeah. Uh, check out the channel, different playlists, lots of variety, and we'll see you next time on the show. Bye.